What's going on guys and welcome back to the Fit Man Cook Kitchen. We are on day five of the Hit and Sweetie Challenge where we are challenging ourselves to get active for at least 15 minutes each day and also enjoying a hard healthy smoothie right after our workout. Now today's video is also inspired by someone that I truly admire in social media and that is Miss Jeanette. You may know her as the Hollywood trainer. She trains up everybody that you can think of. You can think of a movie star, she's probably worked with them. She even works with King Serena, King Serena Williams, if you know what I'm talking about, you know, the tennis pro, yeah, that King Serena. Now getting tortured and, not getting tortured, but working out is so much more enjoyable whenever you have a friend. So I got my buddy Josh here with me today to do this, um, to do this insane workout. As a reminder, this entire workout is 15 minutes. So uh, we're gonna do three rounds of five minute rounds. Each round consists of five exercises. Each exercise is 50 seconds with a 10 second rest in between and then a one minute rest after the entire round. So we're gonna be right at about 15 minutes. Yes. Big jumps. All right, it is smoothie time. I'm gonna give you a hint at what we're making today. If you like, mm, 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 you got that? It's a hint. Okay, we're making a pina colada protein smoothie. Here's what you're gonna need for it. Sneak in a little bit of spinach. It's really easy to incorporate into smoothie recipes. Next, we're gonna add in our heart healthy star today is gonna be walnuts. We use half of banana some pineapple, because what is a pina colada without pineapple? One thing that I really love about pineapple too is that it has this property in it called bromelain, which really is an anti-inflammatory and it's great for recovery after a workout. Next, you're gonna need some protein powder. I'll be using a vanilla whey protein powder, but no worries, you can use a collagen peptide or even a vegan plant-based protein. And some coconut. These are unsweetened coconut flakes. Next, you're gonna pour in some almond milk or some water. This is unsweetened almond milk. It's only about 30 calories per cup, so I'm not concerned about adding this into my smoothie. Top it off with some ice, pop the top, and get to work. Protein pina colada smoothie. It's a brilliant green color. Mmm, just like a party. Feel like I'm on South Beach right now. So make this smoothie, take a picture of it, tag me, and let me know how you enjoyed this smoothie and how you're gonna make it your own and also how you are enjoying the Hit and Smoothies Challenge. 
Okay, I want you all to keep it healthy, but of course, never boring. Enjoy the smoothie. Cheers. Best part for you today. Not most challenging, the best part. The best part? <laughs> Watching Max. Look at running the side of your diet. That had to be the favorite part. Had to be this. He judges me. Whenever I do the home workouts. I don't think Max was impressed by what he was. He was not impressed at all. Definitely go get the Hollywood trainer I follow. She's even got a little, she's got a booty club. I saw that she was on Good Morning America or the Today Show and she was helping women get cuffed in 2018 with a little booty workout. Oh, oh. <laughs> she's gonna kill me for saying that. <laughs> so she's got a lot of great content out there, guys. So just give her a huge follow. This is day five. All good things come to an end, but you gotta stay active, right? You have to. Keep moving. Do you always work out? Every single day. Dang. Every, Every single, single day. day. If I'm, it doesn't have to be an intense workout. Just move. Get out. Go walk. Go for a hike. Go for a run. Do some mobility stuff. Have fun with it. Just keep stay active and keep moving. That's right. There it is. I couldn't say it better. Make it fun. And if you don't have somebody to work out with, find someone. There is somebody out there for you. Just get active. Again, it's not just about going to the gym. You can turn your living room into a gym. But just be sure that you keep your dog before you start working out. Otherwise, <laughs> they're going to come in here and be like, I don't care what you're doing over here. That's a good thing. Exactly. But all I do know is that my bowl is in. Feed it. Feed me. Feed me. Feed me, Sydney. Feed me. Let's get that smoothie. Let's get that smoothie. All right, guys.